and here my dear friends is one more video for you don't forget to subscribe to my channel and share with a friend you guys you know that perhaps the most psychotically honest person in the world is Ray is Ray okay so as you know to back up that honesty of course I had a chance to graduate from Harvard and do surgery at Harvard Medical School uh, and I've written several books one of them which talks about diet okay so um, today I want to talk about sugar sugar is a total complete poison all right so I have almost six I'm almost 60 years old the last time I had a pizza was in 1986 I remember because it was Pinocchio's Pizza Harvard Square <laughs> The last time I had a piece of cake was in 1960s. It was at my own birthday party. The last time uh, I had alcohol was in 74, before I came to America. Um, anyhow, you guys, so I can fight any 19-year-old. I'm going for my fourth degree black belt. You know, I operate seven operations per day. Uh, I'm never tired, I'm never sad. Uh, and super super lean. Why? I do the paleo diet. Paleo diet means what? Very simple. Think like you're on the Amazon as you're going down the aisles of the supermarket. Is there cereal in the Amazon? Of course not. Is there cheese in the Amazon? No. Is there salt in the Amazon? No. What is in the Amazon? Fruits and vegetables and all kinds of meat. That's it. Okay? So the diet that works with us is the paleo diet. We were designed for the paleo diet. If you look at the clock of the world, 12 hours, for 11 hours and a half, we live the paleo diet. But today we have a little thing called industrialized, and it's killing the world. The world has, doesn't have sex anymore. The world is diabetic. The world is hypertensive. The world has heart disease. Uh, the world is impotent. The world is arthritic. All those come from industrialized food. So if it has this fake white, it's industrialized. All right, let's start backwards. I'll give you an idea of sugar, okay? In a soda, you see 40 milligrams. Turn the back. Carbohydrates, 40 milligrams. Let me explain how many spoons of sugar that is. It's 10 spoons of sugar, okay? So 35, obviously, would be like 8 spoons of sugar. Eight heaping spoons of sugar. How is sugar so dangerous? The refining process using elements even like cyanide, even some of the things you found in concentration camps. The refining process in trace amounts has, I was a chemist before I went to medical school. All right, but that's not what worries me. What really worries me is the drug which is sugar. Okay, I'll explain to you. Do a survival class. You do a survival class. I did one in the Adirondacks, interstate New York. I was on an island with a canoe, a fishing pole, and a fire. That's it. I ate the blueberries, and I fished for trout, and I ate trout over the fire. The flavors were very simple. There were no exaggerated flavors. Today you get fast food. That cheeseburger is so exaggerated. You're literally addicted to the flavor. You are addicted to food. So the problem is the following. Nature does not recognize such uh, high sweetness. It doesn't exist in nature. So you get that mango in the Brazilian Amazon, it doesn't have that sweetness. So you eat that donut, Fuck. you eat that donut, your sugar goes from 80 to 250. Your body in panic, because you're going to pass out. Your body in panic creates glucagon. It's a hormone. But the body overshoots it. So your sugar goes from 250 to 53. Now <laughs> you've got to pass out again because your sugar is too low. Now you eat another piece of donut. Who noticed that you never abused pear? but you always abuse the chocolate. Again, you go to 250, and again, you drop to 50, and then again, you go to 50. Well, your pancreas gets tired 
uh, of secreting insulin in your cells lose the sensibility. If I slap you once, oh my God, you're going to cry. But if I keep slapping you every day for 10 years, the slap will have no more influence. Same thing. You keep showering your body with insulin. You, it, it will no longer respond. So that girl, you see that girl, she's chubby. Uh, that girl who's chubby. No, she is on a diet. She does uh, follow a strict diet. Even at home, she's not raiding the refrigerator. How come she's not losing weight? She lost the sensibility to insulin. She abused so much this up or down with sugar, she lost the sensibility to sugar. She is fucked. <coughs> she is screwed. Okay, you guys? So, uh, lucky for you, there's a cure for that. There's a way to return the sensibility. Uh, uh, and that is exercise. It comes back in 24 hours in the paleo diet. Meats, uh, organic meats without estrogens uh, will return the sensibility to insulin, okay? Uh, so sugar then is going to create all the metabolic diseases. Uh, by this up and down, you're going to end up hypertensive, you, obese, zero libido, arthritic, uh, blind, diabetic, heart disease, you're done. All right, what can we take instead? It's not an accident. I'm Brazilian. Look, we're not, uh, we're not ashamed of God. Uh, and I know a lot of Americans are not either. So um, it's not an accident that every other cha chapter in the Bible talks about honey. Not an accident. Honey is a miracle. Honey is a miracle. Today we're using a lot on wounds. What are we using on wounds? Honey. Circle closes. We used to use honey 300 years ago. Now we're using honey. It's a brutal antibiotic. It has all the minerals and vitamins in it. But most important, it has a very high glycemic index. It's very sweet, <laughs> but it's a complex carbohydrate. Uh, that white sugar is in your fat cells in 15 minutes. Honey takes 24 hours to be digested. So you guys, stop eating industrial sugar because you're going to have all the syndrome X diseases, and substitute it for honey, okay? I love you guys. Till next time, let's take care of our temple because your time has come. If not you, then who? If not now, then when?